Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to part 36 of Let's Play. The Lost Legion on the Eagle Rising mod. My brain just... Uh, we had a little crash, so I just restarted the recording, but uh, yeah, my brain just crashed there as well. So it wasn't just the game that crashed, it was my brain. Uh, we are on the lookout for a single troop as well. Let's see if we can find one that will... Uh... Holy crap. As luck would have it, yeah, we actually could. Um, I don't have anything to throw away. Um... Still don't have a herd, which is really good, but we've got one more city to go through before we decide to finally bring the Byzantines back into what is now going to be called the Lost Imperium. Because, well, we're we're not just a legion anymore. But the, obviously the campaign is still going to be called the Lost Legion, so do not worry. But the, the Lost Imperium makes more sense for the name of the Imperium now. As we, uh... Well, we've we've essentially, effectively, like forced all other Imperiums into us. Just ignore the fact that there is still technically one left. We, you know, they they don't own any Imperium land. They are unimportant, just absolute pieces of shit. That's what they are. Uh. Okay, that we might. Yeah, we're gonna say we might finally have a herd. Uh, we'll drop down to there. Drop down to there. You know, fuck it. I'll take the herd. I'll take the herd penalty. It'd be funnier. What's a, you know, what's a herd penalty at this level? You know, 1.9? That's still surprisingly fast, actually. Uh, yes, yeah, so we're going to go and immediately get ready to go take Thessalonica. So as soon as we get to this bridge, we will declare the war. Okay, the only downside is we go really fucking slow at night. So actually, let us... Uh, We'll get rid of all the cows, we'll get rid of all the hogs, and we'll leave it at there. Okay, there we go. See, we're going a little bit faster now. I like it. Yeah. So essentially, we have, like, a fuck ton of meat. Uh, we have 154 days of meat now in the party. Now, that is what we like to see, obviously. Uh, you've got your stewardship. Um, yep, siege engine build rate, please. Uh, aid core, yeah, aid core. Okay. All right. All right, Byzantine Empire. It's time we rid you off the map with our seventy-five thousand strength. Holy shit, we're just stupidly powerful. Yeah, straight to Thessalonica. Time for us to put in a bit of hurt. Uh, how big are my vassal armies right now? 2,500 between them, so we still alone are singly stronger, but uh, it's fine. Uh, we got over encumbered. I mean, I mean, we technically have got over encumbrance, but let's uh, Ain't getting rid of that herd anytime soon. Uh, so yeah, we're going to go take the city. So we're going to take Thessalonike, Athena, and then Constantinople. Uh, any sieges in terms of uh, up here or the castles, we will leave to our vassals for now. Uh, they are currently... Yeah, you're probably going to go that way. These two will probably go deal with that for us. We'll deal with Thessalonike for now. Kiev has risen up again. What the hell? I think that's the second time we've seen it rise up. Yeah, Thessalonike has a, a lot of people. So it's going to be a very interesting siege, uh, start a siege to begin with, because there's just so many people here. Come on then. Come on then, Thessalonike. Let's do this. Let's have a nice, big, bloody fight. Uh, so we'll build up, obviously, all the siege engines. Um, we'll probably have to build catapults as well, more than likely. Ooh, uh, dungeon architect, architect or siege engineer. Yeah, extra health for siege engines is always nice. I don't. I think it's only me who will fix it. But then, if, then again, if everyone in our party actually gives ten percent, our uh, siege engines will have would have had stupid amount of health, and that would make no sense. Now I'm not expecting. Um, you know, I don't know. What, sorry, uh, what I wanted to say is I don't know what to expect. Is what I'm just trying to say. 
Because we've never fought the Byzantines, and I've never actually used their units. So I do not know to what degree their strengths are going to, you know, pre uh, present themselves. Are they going to be stupidly weak? Are they going to be really powerful? Like, how are they going to compare to the Legionari we've got and the Auxilia? Are they going to prove problematic? In like, good? Shit? You know, it is very much... We don't know, and we're, the, all we're going to have to do is wait and find out. Yeah, these these do seem to be... But they do seem to be very quickly building here. I have no intention of killing all the garrison this time, like I did uh, in the other places. I just want to build... Um, you know what? We're going to put you in thing. We're going to start slowly building our... Um, things. Well, there. Uh, Keep the walls slowly going down as we build our new uh, catapults. Put you there, put you there, move you, build you, get rid of you two, build those two. There we go. Move you away, get the last trebuchet back out, and then we'll... Uh, see, we'll only have one more catapult to build now. Okay, shit, this might have... Uh, this may have backfired horribly on me, actually. But at least we'll have the catapults ready for when we actually charge in and, you know, kick the wall down. As they say. Oh, uh, hell. Oh, Askia's castle is being sieged. I really don't care. Okay, yeah, good. We'll get rid of you and we'll leave uh, put you there. Right. Okay, you're down. Get rid of you. I just need to build the last one and we're golden. Get a save as, and let's break into this biatch. Right, let's do this. Like I said, I am very interested to see what their troops are like, as we haven't fought them before at all. So hopefully they'll offer an interesting amount of, uh, you know, an interesting uh, level of strength against us. But maybe not. We will have to wait and see. Obviously, we do have fire catapults, so we are going to be doing more than likely quite a bit of damage just from that. So they have Byzantine Legionari, Byzantine Bucarelli, Bucalari. Double Cataphracti, Palatine Archer, Veteran Archer, Veteran Legionari, High Crossbows. I don't know what their uh, Legionari are like, though. So uh, they might be on the same level as us, or they might just be trash. We'll have to wait and see. That's a Palatine Archer right there, though. I, I can tell that without needing any sense of worry right there. Okay, lads. Let's see what these guys look like. Yeah, they look as like exactly as you'd expect them to do. Oh shit! Yeah, we don't want. Oh crap! I went too quickly in. Oh piss. Yeah, this is where we're gonna. Yeah, we're gonna get slapped down because I got stuck. That's not fair. Bullshit. And troops. Just get this over. We lost 29 of our troops. Um. Okay, yeah. So they, these are just basically base game troops. And these guys have rang in, yeah. Uh, we don't want any of your units because they're um kind of useless to us because they're not what we need. I will take all of your loot, though. We'll, of course, show mercy and let's do a quick bit of trading. Um, rid of those hides. And, uh, here we go. We'll just sell everything straight away so that we don't, uh, we do not need any more, um, any more of those. Thank you. I appreciate the offer of whether or not we would like some more, um, what's it called? But the answer is no. We do not need any more sheep. We, uh, we are not Welsh. We do not need uh, a large number of sheep. 
Uh, best medicine or good lodgings? Best medicine, sure. Cool. Okay, first of Nike is done. Um, we we lost a massive amount of men there. That was a very hard battle, a uh, very hard fought battle for us. Well, for my men, I really didn't do much. Let's go take uh, Athens. So we'll uh, we'll go. We'll have to walk around. I'm hoping, yeah, they're going over there to deal with that. You're go gathering up there, so I'm assuming you're going to go for Razafa. I'm hoping that we can get. I'm, I am kind of hoping we'll get like some semblance of um, actual fights, but we'll see. Well, at least we're giving stuff to different people now, but uh, still doesn't seem to be many people in our empire uh, getting land. I don't even have the most shit anymore, which is surprising. Okay, so you are about to get over there to defend it. They are being... Oh, nope, you're just ignoring them. It looks like we may take a loss there. I mean, it's okay. Uh, I didn't expect to come out of this unscathed, but... Yeah, a bit weird that they just walked, like, completely off. I'm assuming they started chasing someone. Right, let's go back down here. How close are we to... Okay, yeah, we're nearly at Athena. Athena. And then we'll take Constantinople and we'll... Yeah, okay, they got the castle defended. Good lads. Uh, let's make sure we set our people as being uh, uh, offensive. Now go take as much as you can. Right. Hopefully I'll actually get, uh, you know, to actually partake this time instead of, you know, getting my head kicked in. It would be nice. Go. Slowly but surely. I would like to be building quicker, but, you know, we're, we're never that lucky. To be fair, we build pretty quickly already. Any quicker would be a little unfair, I'd say. We have even more food now because our people keep getting killed. How good is Athena? Because I don't think we've actually looked at its... Uh, 16,000, not bad. It's definitely going to provide, um, you know, a lot of... Uh, value to our empire in terms of monetary. Uh, we've already taken 5,000 of their strength. Okay, yeah. Something tells me these last wars are more just uh, ticking boxes than actual fights. I kind of feel bad because it, it doesn't seem to like... There doesn't seem to be any real need for us to do... Um, kind of, you know, we, we, at this point it feels like we're just, we've won. You know, it feels like there's not going to be really any be, be any field battles, and yeah, we've essentially just we've we've won. Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to. Yeah, we're gonna have to pause you, because uh, if we don't, we're just gonna lose all our trebs, and that's gonna be horrible. I mean, we already lost, we already lost them all once. We don't really want to lose them all again. Three trebs well, should be enough. Because they normally, they take out enemies pretty quickly, but uh, apparently they just want to absolutely fucking suck right now, which is about right. I think the ballistas are only really problematic because they shoot so quickly and they... I don't know if they're accurate or not, but they do seem to be doing a lot of damage. Uh, don't see anything else getting sieged. That's interesting. Okay, we should be done in a moment. Walls will be down and we'll be uh, ready to go on in. As soon as we have built fire catapults. To cover my own behind. Because we're going to need them. Alright, the walls are broken, which means uh, we don't need uh, trebs anymore. We just need catapults. Beautiful. So, I'm looking forward to uh, absolutely slapping these guys across their little uh, Byzantine heads. They are Greek, they are not Roman, and we need to we need to teach them that lesson. 
Get a quick save as, and we'll uh, burn this place to the ground. Oh, we nearly started letting them die of uh, attrition as well. Oh, we don't want that. That would be upsetting. There we go. I don't know why the save as always takes so long. I definitely think I need to clear out some of the saves and then also make sure the stupid Google Cloud, uh, sorry, Steam Cloud doesn't, you know, decide it wants to re-download all of them. I still, I must admit, I've never actually messed about with that, so I should probably figure out how to do that. Anyway, let's launch an assault. Right, order to boy. Let's go. They've got a lot of Varen archers, a lot of Palatine archers. They, they have some really good defenses here. Byzantine explorers. That I don't know why they are. Because we can't accept, access the encyclopedia while we're here. So the best thing we can do is just let our men throw a bunch of shit at them. The catapults, you know, take out what we can. I mean, the explorers could be cavalry. They could be anything. I actually just legitimately do not know who they are. Damn it. That looked like it would, you know, hit them. Fucking hell. I actually, yeah, did not expect any of those to hit. Right. Yeah, we clearly do not want to be near these dipshits because they'll uh, do a lot of damage to us. We do seem to be doing... Like, it, we seem to be trading. We don't seem to be just straight up winning, which is worrying. It looks like uh, we may be having uh, a trouble when we finally get to field battles. Okay, yeah, Byzantine Explorers are cavalry. They definitely are. I'm obviously willing to test that theory by uh, checking after the um, after the fight's finished. I have a fucking shield. How am I sucking against you guys? Uh, we've lost. Yeah, they're, like, actually trading really well with us. This isn't, like, a straight victory like I was you'd expect it to be. Oh, my God. Yeah, these Byzantines are very well, um, uh, outfitted. My God. Yeah, we're going to get knocked out purely because we're starting to get overrun. And I don't think I can survive against these guys until, uh, you know, I'm... Yeah, I, I didn't think I was going to get survive much longer. Holy shit, they're absolutely massacring our men. Another 15 loss. Holy shit. And yeah, the explorers are the top tier cavalry. That explains a lot. Bloody hell. So I lost a pillars prior. And, and that's it. But like, shit, that's... Painful, to say the least. Uh, get a trainer... Yeah, imposing stature. Um, military tradition, why not? Yeah, we've got you at least. Fucking hell. So what have I lost? Like, how many Aquilia legionaries do I have now? 
Okay, I still have a decent amount of them. It's not too bad. If only I could recruit all those lost legionaries. That would be great. But, uh, yeah, I have a distinct feeling that ain't fucking gonna happen. But let's just sell as much of this shit as we can, you know? Yep, we can sell everything. Good. Alright, let's leave. Okay. We have already gone down over a thousand troops after those two sieges. Which is kind of scary, in a sense. I did not expect to take so much immediate damage. Such is life, unfortunately. But uh, we will figure it out. I uh, think I'm actually going to go down. I am going to go down and take Crete. And then we can... Uh, we'll go take Constantinople afterwards. Flipping hell. That's... I did not expect such a bloodbath. Uh, yeah, they've inflicted so many casualties. They have lost a lot of strength, but that doesn't really mean much when they're still, you know, doing so well. Oh, the herd is even worse now. How is the herd even worse? I mean... Oh, I've got some more sumptures, I think. Oh, no, wait. Yeah, we, uh, that was, there we go. This castle better not be as painful as I'm expecting it to be. Yeah, we need to take that castle and Constantinople, and, uh, I'd say that's, uh, a good goddamn start to the war. And for how much damage they've done to me, I want to make sure that we, we don't leave these guys alive. We're destroying them. I am going to spend the entirety of the next couple of parts just absolutely destroying them. Because that is what needs to happen. I also think we... Yeah, we should be able to build quick enough that we don't need to uh, rely on um, putting our things away, I'd hope. Yeah, I'd like to say we... Yeah, we, we should be fine. Yeah, hopefully we continue making, uh, you know, our vassals get sieges and we aren't relying on ourselves, essentially. Uh, the surgeon. Get better at uh, sieging, please. Anyone else got to level up? Let's have a look who uh, is Lathia. She got better at, at this. Uh, carry animal capacity up. Yeah, minus. Oh, yeah, because we the herd's getting worse because we've got... Yeah, okay, that makes sense. I just thought about it and my brain was like, yeah, no, the herd makes sense now because we've got less people in the party to, you know, help us with them. It makes complete sense. Because every one person can have... Um, Um, a certain amount of, uh, sheep. A certain amount of, like, herd animals. Yeah, honestly, I may just need to get rid of these guys. I don't know if I can be fucking bothered to, uh, do anything else with them. All right, the walls are down. There we go. Let's do, do a quick save. We'll break this down, and this will probably be the last siege we get this part, but... We'll go straight to Constantinople after this. We're not gonna uh, we're not gonna dick about. Because they're probably gonna have a lot of men there, and that's gonna be a pain in the ass. Let's be honest, we, we don't want it to be a pain in the ass. Right. Auto deploy, let's go. The siege, this, uh, so castle sieges should not be a problem. There is some um, Ayabid troops here as well. Not really gonna be, and there's some obviously militia. I'm gonna say we should be fine here. Just have to wait and see, you know? I think the uh, right flank is where we're gonna uh, make our mark.
I am overthrowing too far or too close. There we go. Right. If we can press through these, we should be able to win. These look like a, a bunch of militia. These look like a bunch of militia. Oh, there's nowhere near as many uh, normal troops as I thought there was. Oh my god. Who the fuck is it? Oh, you. You must have shot me in the back. I lost way too much health on uh, there. Yeah, someone keeps shooting me. And it's like doing a lot more damage than I'm uh, able to take, really. Yeah, the Varangains hit as hard as shit as, as you'd expect. You know, for being uh, Vikings. The hell are you? Oh, you're a Byzantine trained archer. Well, now you're dead. Yeah, you're a Byzantine dead archer. <laughs> oh, so funny. 10 out of 10 would uh, make that shit pun again. I'm going to get taken out by archers, aren't I? Yep. As always. No point in letting you go to a key battle when we're um, not going to be able to join. Again, no prisoners for us. Beautiful. Castle occupied. There is actually one thing I want to look into the castles because it's something I've been I've had on my mind for a little bit. So yeah, these are the same. I thought they were. Right, so let's go the quickest way to get to Constantinople. Probably go over this ferry point, walk through hostile territory, and then go through the uh and go through another ferry point. Um I have maxed out my uh, ability to use one handed. Good for me. We're up under two thousand, like holy shit game. Um we are very weak on in terms of our army now. Like our army's been just absolutely rid of any sense of troops. I'm sorry, how the fuck did they just disappear there? Okay, cool. We took that castle up there as well. Beautiful. Right, we now need to get to there. Uh they're trying to go siege there again. We could try and stop them doing that. I mean the likelihood of us actually getting to go up there to stop it is probably not very high, but we'll at least try. You know, it could be worth it in the end. Just have to wait and see, won't we? I definitely think we'd fare so much better doing field battles. But uh, yeah, it's never that easy to just do field battles, you know? I know I paid for these sheep, but I'm getting rid of like a load of them. Yep, over four thousand sheep now. Just you know, in the in the uh, in the breeze. Are they attacking yet? Not yet. Okay, so we still got time. Not a lot of time, but we've got some time. Ah, oh, damn it! They're going to the castle to defend. Uh, Constantinople has less people than Athena and uh, Thessalonica. They're going at 2.1. We might be able to catch up and get, you know, go past them. Um, we will see. Ooh, you're not, fuck it. We're going to go down there and stop them over there. I know this is essentially expensive because I've, you know, just paid to come over here, but realistically, money is not a problem. Um, but once we take Constantinople, we'll then uh, be able to worry about, you know, taking everything over here. I mean, they don't have as much land as you'd expect them to do, and their, their land seems a little bit more uh, open as... Oh, okay. I took the one with only 65. Okay, that's... I mean, it only has 25 fucking defenders, so it's not like it matters. I give up. Yep, that was essentially what I'd call a waste of a siege, but let's just chuck some troops in here. There we go. The garrison is now a little bit better. Oh, you fucking doesn't matter it looks like yep they they were able to defeat the army alone 
Fair enough, doesn't matter. You go do you. Uh, you're traveling to Thessaloniki. You're traveling over to there to siege. Good for you guys. You're all doing useful things. Well done. All right, let's go siege Constantinople. Uh, we'll finally be taking the jewel over here. I won't, unfortunately, be allowed to give it to myself, but such is life. If I could only get the lovely diplomacy mod to work, but, uh, well, the diplomacy mod has been very honest with me in saying it does not fucking want to work. Um, and apparently we're only allowed one siege tower in this siege. Um... Yeah, where the fuck are the other siege towers? Found it. It's hidden directly under a rock. Beautiful. Lathia, congratulations. You're now better at sieging. Uh, damage to Wilder and Siege. My that one. But unfortunately, guys, we're going to have to end this part here. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy, please do follow me on YouTube. Leave a like, leave a comment, leave a share. But most importantly, guys, stay safe. Have a great day. Join the channel memberships if you're interested. And I'll see you in the next one. See you guys then.